We're at New Fira Stadium in Snuffalo, home of the thrills. Ah, it sure does get cold here in Snuffalo. Did you know that when the NFL first started, its very first season, a Snuffalo player suffered a high quarters ass capitation? Yeah, it was it was seven when he was tackled and, and it froze before he hit the ground. And thus the saying was born to freeze one own's ass up. Let's play some football. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The Diami Krakens take on the Snuffalo Thrills. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my mental. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot, hot one. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Defense has the receivers covered well. That's a three-yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. trying to fuck a grease football. He gets away in a hurry. And it's first and ten. Second down and long.
and it's first and ten. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And they strike the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of... Well, that play didn't work. He'll have to reset that. Third down and nine. One, hot two, eight. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. And I've had it. I'm running out of it. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. First and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade! Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And he just slipped away. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Beat for Brain Man with a ball didn't fall down. See that boot, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights.
They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I mean, and anything really tastes good. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast to get... That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Seriously, man, you think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh could it be mine? And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was! Second down and a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. This guy's a brick shit house. Oh, what a brutal hit. Is that right, Glenn? That penalty makes no sense. Yeah, it's something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. <laughs> And that'll be second down, and defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, man, he really wants it. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball.
second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Third and four. Defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Take them. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And he's running like a boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly... Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. Picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. His big ass will probably show up. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and ten. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two. And he 
he's off to the races. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Second down and more than, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one. Bricks, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for it. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Oh. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls it. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Oh. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Oh. Well, it's a fair question. Second down and ten. That's a four-yard gain. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. continues to climb. Now the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. quarter about to begin here and these guys are locked in a nearly dead heat i was locked in a dead heat under the covers last night when brick started farting like a fourth of july fireworks finale <laughs> when you get knocked down you got to get right back up and fight uh, what about when you get knocked
When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. And it's first and ten. Nice run for five yards. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort. And he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they don't have the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What day is it? First down and five. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means he can wrap up the other half and save it for later. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they don't have the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Second down and five. Just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All they need is 77 to fight it. His cleats are... Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schlong Galaxy phone. The Snuffle Thrills get their butts whipped and lose by forfeit. The thrill is gone, Grim. The 
well as gone. It shows most of your brain. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.